And on COVID tonight, the startling images coming out of Shanghai, a major spike in COVID cases there. And tonight, more than 25 million people are in lockdown, confined to their homes. Drones flying past their homes, past their apartment buildings, with messages from the Chinese authorities on what they can and cannot do. ABC's Britt Clinton from Hong Kong tonight. Tonight, an eerie quiet on the streets of Shanghai, China's largest city paralyzed with 25 million residents under lockdown. Two weeks in, officials are struggling to deliver groceries to residents who are stuck in their homes and some running out of food. I still have some, some cereals left, uh, not much, but from fruits I only have this lemon. At night, frustrated residents calling out to their neighbors. The BA2 variant now fueling China's worst COVID outbreak yet. Infections are topping 26,000 a day, but officially there have been no deaths reported. Still, China is doubling down on its zero COVID policy aimed at stamping out every infection. Government drones hover overhead, ordering residents to get tested. Some in low-risk areas can now leave their homes, but all infected people are sent to hospitals or isolation centres. Images like these from early in the lockdown sparking outrage. <laughs> Toddlers with COVID separated from their parents, prompting officials to relax some of those rules. David, the US has now ordered all non-emergency staff to leave Shanghai. The State Department citing the outbreak itself and China's COVID policies, including the risk of children and parents being separated. David.